Hey, what's going on, guys? Asad here, and in this tutorial, I'm gonna talk about the negative infinity number in the JavaScript engine. So, what it does is the yeah, it, the lowest number after that it gonna goes as infinity. So, in that way, uh, that you can check it out that is that uh, more than that or not. So, this is uh, this will be the probably the best way to create calculate or something so what I'm gonna do is just get a function and uh, what I'm gonna do now is check a number and then uh, pass a parameter called small number and then what I'm gonna do next is check that if the small number equals to the number dot negative infinity so I n phi n i t y yeah so if that that happened what I'm gonna do is return this function returns the uh, uh, you know process as infinity so process as uh, process as in minus infinity I mean because uh, it's the you know negative infinity so and now and if uh, not it not then normally it gonna give you the return the number uh, instead I'm gonna not that instead of returning the number I'm gonna say uh, a string uh, your uh, your number is okay your number number is okay and ne next thing what we need to do is uh, now what we need to do is, is log it on the console and we're gonna check a number so nah, use that function check number and then I'm gonna pass the minus negative uh, max value so number uh, you can also use the min value it doesn't matter so dot not comma dot max value so when we do that it says radio number is okay because you know it doesn't pass that number so and if we do that uh, just multiply into two it will say process as infinity so hope you guys understand this is the way we deal with the uh, negative infinity so see you guys in the next tutorial